something that I'm passionate about is New York City. So I decided to do like a kind of modern apartment building or skyscraper in New York City. And there was this new one that just came out like a few years ago or whatever. That's really cool. It's 432 Park Avenue. So that was the influence for my project here. So inside, I did do the interior, but you'll, you'll see soon, I mean, it's not in-depth interior, I just wanted to kind of make it look like an apartment building or somewhere, I don't know. So, I mean, this is supposed to be a kind of lobby that has the sofas. I'm gonna, I have not lit this up yet, it's about to be hella lit, so we're gonna put some torches in here. There. Staircase, is this a simple staircase? Uh, I don't know, I'm proud of it though. So let's light this up, this is kind of like a book room. Yeah, more books, a treasure chest, and a furnace for some reason, maybe for decoration. Yeah, let's say it's for decoration. Oh, we have some good artwork in here. Good artwork, and as we get higher, the view gets better. Um, yeah, that's a, that's a good picture right there. This is supposed to be a TV. Um, here's some more books. As, yeah, you're starting to feel what I'm saying. It's not in depth, but I wanted to do it since it's like apartment building, just not straight up build the outside. Um, let's go back up. Uh, yeah, I like the windows in this room. More books, of course. This is a lot of beds. I don't know why there's a lot of beds. This is, I don't know, a suite. I guess I'd say good view. You can see the deck. It's pretty cool. Oh, good sunrise. Um, yeah, a glass railing. Okay, yeah, so you see the columns of books and then there's a bed surrounded by gold. I guess if you just want to read in royalty. That was my idea there. Good windows here. I like the sunrise area. I did plan that. I did plan that on that side. Um, this is more like a studio. Feel me, just a different kind of take on a, another room. Just some artwork that somebody's working on in a studio. Up here we have a hot tub. If I could do it again, I I wish I had more time. I, I guess I'd try to make it out of gold, not out of bricks, but I kinda like the rusty look. There's the inside of the slide. As you can see, there's nothing too exciting. I just had to build it. I just thought it was cool. This is a luxury bed here, with some books. <laughs> oh. It's one of the weaker rooms in the whole place. Okay, this is, but I make up for it here. There's a little, there's two uh, chairs. There's another TV, I like that, yes. This is what I'm talking about. TV, and there's a big bed over there. Yeah, you can fit a lot of people in that. Don't know why you would, but you can. A lot of books. I don't know who reads this much, but well, maybe Ty Lopez. Here in my garage, just bought this uh, new Lamborghini here. It's fun to drive up here in the Hollywood Hills. But you know what I like a lot more than materialistic things? Knowledge. In fact, I'm a lot more proud of these seven new bookshelves that I had to get installed to hold 2,000 new books that I bought. You know, I read a book a day not to show off. It's again about the knowledge. And this is pretty cool. So I guess, let's see, there's a bed. There's a bed, and as you can see, it's outside. This is really the penthouse. And it has a cool roof, you know? 
There's a little seat, a TV, not facing the uh, bed. That's just the design I had. The other one's facing the bed. For some reason, oh yeah, there is a ladder to go up on the side. And there is the slide. I guess I'll save that. Yeah, let's go over here. There's three beds on each side, and then the big main bed. Yeah, and then there's a little pool on the outside. Now that's cool. I, r I really love the pool. Again, glass railing. And let's just ride down this slide.